just got ready and I am waiting for my friend Brenda to come pick me up we're going to a very fun activity I'm gonna talk more about it when um, I am with her but I just wanted to show you my outfit before we go I do want to mention that this whole video is in partnership with cotton and I will talk about them a little bit later and more in detail about the whole brand because I love them so much also I'm sorry that it's so dark in here it's a super rainy day out today which is actually perfect for our activity that we are about to do. But before that, I wanna talk about these jeans. They are from Cotton. Ever since I got them, I've been obsessed with them. They have the most amazing fit. These are the anti-fit jeans. The waist is a perfect height and looseness for me. And then the leg has enough give where like, they're not super tight, but they're also not too baggy. They have enough bagginess also at the butt where like, it's not super tight. And honestly, I'm not saying that because I'm working with them. They sent me these jeans to try out and I immediately fell in love. And I was like, I've been looking for these jeans my entire life. I don't know why the fit is just so perfect on these but anyways i don't want to be too late and brenda is gonna like yell at me because i'm running late so i'm gonna finish getting ready and we're gonna go <laughs> hi guys we are doing a very fun thing today we are going to a tea house or high tea or i actually don't know if that's like the proper way to say it but you know the little british tea room british tea room um and now we're there and i have to stop talking but yeah <laughs> Um, so in Canada, like, oh my god, it's so good. Grab it by the edge like this. To so tell that they are really funny. Okay, and then once you run out of those, we'll both to ask you on a scale of one to ten how yeah. good was the tea place i'd say an eight i would give it a nine. Oh, wow yeah like I'd i give it an eight because there wasn't enough savory stuff okay that's fair okay yeah. like an 8.5 yeah okay it's like hella bright <laughs> where are we going oh um yeah Why, it's always awkward when other people are here. Or in Wait, did we go here before? Yeah, that's why. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Can someone buy this for me? Oh, so I can buy this.
Hey guys, so I just got home and I wanted to show you um, another piece from Cotton. Their knitted cardigan and it is so cozy. You can just tell like the material is such good quality and it's gonna last a long time. It's not like too thin, but it's also not too thick. The perfect length at the bottom. And I also have this other cable knit sweater. It's so cozy, little details on it, and it's the perfect thickness. I mean, look, this is a whole fit right here. And I also want to mention that for Black Friday, Cotton is not having a sale. However, they're going to donate 100% of the proceeds from over this weekend to building three schools. They've been doing this for six years now. And they do all of this in partnership with a local NGO in Egypt that helps build schools in rural communities and continues to help with operations and different programs. And as I'm sure that you know, education is one of the most important and fundamental aspects of a child's life that they need and everyone should have access to and I think it's so beautiful that Cotton is helping the communities through economy building and education and making sure they have all the resources they need and I highly encourage you guys to support their initiative and also get yourself some very quality and long-lasting pieces from Cotton so you can use Alia 15 to get 15% off of your order and now Yoni and I actually are gonna head out to a coffee shop and try to do some work because even though I have this Friday off I still need to get some work done so let's go do that now we're gonna go to a coffee shop and we both have a lot of editing to do so it's the perfect weather to just like get cozy it get really a nice is. get a nice beverage um, it's kind of raining a little bit so. why am I just looking at the camera and smiling I don't know <laughs> are you happy or something I don't know I think just mostly um, it's the weather that I really, really appreciate, mm -hmm. and it just really gets me focused. You yeah, know what I'm saying yeah. when when it's when it's like rainy and dark outside and cloudy, I get super focused. Yeah, I don't know if anybody else feels that way, but yeah, that's just I me. agree. And especially, there's something really satisfying about the fact that we both know that we have to edit a lot, and sometimes that can be like really overwhelming. But if you know you gotta be cozy and you get to just like be inside. You don't feel bad about it. So you're like, you know what? Let me just get this work done. But today is Friday. So I actually have the day off from work, like my full-time job. So I can put on my YouTuber hat for the day and like catch up with work because I'm pretty behind. And why, why, um, why are you out of breath right now? Why am I out of breath? I don't know. Holding the camera out and talking is like, you know, it's hard. It is a gorgeous day out today, right? Did I have the same jacket on yesterday? I hope not. I mean, like, you know, how many jackets are you expected to have? I just don't want people to think I... I, uh, I, I you only own one jacket? Yeah. Well, I, this, I actually got this jacket... Wow, this lighting. I actually got this jacket yesterday when we went um, thrifting with my friend. But I'm wearing the same jeans that I wore yesterday. So, you know, it's fine to, like, repeating outfits. Like, what are we... We need to... We're we need not to, shaming we need repeating to, outfits. We need to normalize repeating outfits, okay? Yeah, you're the one that was like, are you really gonna wear those jeans again? And I was like, yes! They're so comfortable. Everyone thinks it's so funny how I'm not on the plane. No. <laughs> you can go. You can go. 
go up there and do it. Like What's this? this? Like the, you know, the struggle of doing an outfit check. If you've seen reels of people like in New York always doing outfit checks on the street, it's a constant battle in Seattle because the architecture is just not made for that. Talk about the weather today, alright? <laughs> oh, sorry, but I feel like I talk about the weather in every video that I make, but it's because it's a big, huge part of our I'm not lives. Not gonna lie to you, today is a great day to live in Seattle. Yeah, okay? today is like a day where I could live here. Like I would be okay with living here Yo, for a longer time. We need to. Um... I feel like we're shitting on Seattle all the time. It's funny because I'm always talking shit about Seattle, but then people always say that like, oh, you make me want to move there. I'm trying to figure out um, a place to go eat. So, so that's like, the, that's the usual battle of the weekend. You know, the first battle is getting a nice outfit. Okay, so checked, nice. And fe being satisfied with like the outfit when you're walking outside. And then the second challenge, is figuring out where you're gonna go eat if you go eat somewhere. Sometimes you just have to go outside and not even really know where your destination is. So this is what we're doing today. Oh, it's so hard for me to go outside. We're literally. Destination. We don't know where we're going right now. Yeah, we're just walking around, you know, enjoying the weather. So um, we'll see where we end up. Starbucks, you don't gotta ask for shit, they just give it to you. <laughs> oh my God. I was giving Yoni shit earlier because he was saying how Starbucks is really good and how like people like to shit on it because whatever, you guys know. So Yoni was like, okay, let's put it, put it to the test and see if it's good. So, um... I've never got... Listen, I gotta tell you something about Starbucks, okay? Starbucks is not the worst coffee shop as like you know, people make it or try to make it seem. I think it just became like a trend to say, I'm gonna go to a local coffee shop and not support Starbucks, which is, I get it. Okay. I get it, you gotta support the locals, but you can't tell me that Starbucks is not actually good. Okay. now and it's obviously dark outside I didn't really film anything for a while just because we were just chilling at home weren't doing much which is like what we felt like doing because it was it's a Saturday night um, but now we're gonna go get some dinner so we're gonna go to our favorite spot our go-to little neighborhood pizza pasta place Sunday and I 
have just been finishing up and editing a video that I now posted and you need to finish some things up before I could post it like my thumbnail and you know obviously like uploading it and all that and now I'm free once I post my video I feel like the weight is off my shoulders and I can live my best life but it's a pretty beautiful day out today so I'm thinking we might just go get some quick breakfast um, maybe like a bagel, uh, bacon, egg, and cheese, which is our, it's become like our Sunday morning tradition. And I don't know where else. We might like run some errands. I kind of just really need like a chill day because it's been a busy and chaotic couple of weeks. Actually, the sweater that I'm wearing right now says I love Egypt, I'm pretty sure. It also has um, a little heart on the back, you know. And um, so all of these drawings were made by the children that go to the schools that Cotton funds and helps out with in Egypt and is in partnership with Kids Worldwide. This collection is only available for the Black Friday weekend. So if you want them, you gotta go get them and support the cause. Um, but yeah, so I'm probably gonna get ready. Yoni is still like getting out of bed and we're gonna go get some breakfast. Thank you. 